Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll review the Sedap Mi Segera Singapore Spicy Laksa Noodle. That was a mouthful. I actually ran out of breath just saying that. Sorry about that. Anyway, I found this on 7-Eleven. This is not sponsored. It's just a random thing that I saw. I was kind of craving for laksa. I have this beef, which I know is not really a match. But you know, everything is going to be homemade. So bear with me. I did find some eggs, some spring onion, a little bit of the beef, and then the sedap. Singapore spicy laksa noodle. So I was thinking I could boil the egg, make it into a topping, and then add a little bit of the spring onion and then the beef just to you know give it more flavor, a little bit of meat. And so here it is. I boiled the meat. I did try to remember that you're supposed to boil the meat and then throw away the water because that's dirty water but i didn't have much time and i figured it might be dirty but it's a little bit clean don't come for me okay and then i added the noodles there you go at the same time i was already boiling the eggs just to kind of save up on time and maximize everything and then uh i was feeling really hungry so there you go i added the noodles trying to soften it up I tried to remember that you're not supposed to like overcook the noodles because it will be soggy. And then I was actually blown away because they have so many packets. Like normally the Philippine noodles would have two, three max. They had four. Like there was four. And then there was one that had like, you know, the chili on it. I did not use that. Sorry. But I'm not really um, a fan of super spicy food. Yeah, sorry. So, I'm not a fan of super spicy food. Though, I've been trying to really eat more of it. Because some spicy foods are really, 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 you know, like super good. So, what I saw online was that it was best to actually put all of the spices on the bowl. Because before, what I would do is I'd have the noodle and then I'd pour all of the spices on top. Apparently, that makes it a little bit hard to kind of mix everything. So, that was something that I learned online. So, now, um, this is me doing exactly that. Or trying to, anyway. Um, I was just, again, really, really blown away, shocked, surprised that there were so many packets. Um, but, again, I chose not to add the one that had the spicy chili on like the drawing, like on the content, the packaging, because I was scared. <laughs> Truth be told, I was scared. It scared me. Like looking at it, I was like, hmm, am I brave enough to do this? I would go, no. Um, and I decided to just, you know, not go for it. As far as I remember, I didn't go for it because, you know, um, yeah, so that's the one. And, uh, that's just so scary. Ooh, I am actually opening it. Mm. <laughs> okay, so apparently I did go for it. Uh, this is why actually I had my husband and my son eat this. You see, my baby is a fan of spicy food. I know, he's two years old. But he feels the spice. Like he kind of freaks out that it's all spicy. But at the same time, he demands more. Like, he wants more. You'll see it in the video later on. So, this was taken actually like three weeks ago. I forgot about it. Which is why I thought, you know, I threw it away. But I did not. So, old age. Okay, and then now we're mixing it using the water from the noodle and the beef. And you can see how orangey it is. And what I remember is that if anything is like too orangey or too red, that means that it will be... Whew, spicy so there you go as you can see it looks very orangey and very spicy and actually it just looks scary and then i cut some spring onions uh just to give it a little bit more color and i've learned that you know just adding a few vegetables here and there actually makes a difference okay now we have here 
the eggs i actually sliced this using a machinery like a small one where you just kind of pull on the contraption and then you have your eggs looking like this very pretty this is not the most palatable looking thing i didn't get to like wipe the sides but you know this is how it really looks like um there's the me set up thing <laughs> me set up me segera okay so again this is like a random review don't come for me i'm not an expert i'm especially not an expert with singapore laksa but i have tried it i loved it except for the super spicy part but overall loved it been looking for it I did actually give this one a try as mentioned you know I'm really trying to up my spicy game but <sighs> so there I was feeling actually a little bit worried about this and I'm like there <laughs> I look really silly right and then I was like you know what let's just give this one a try as well and I regretted it instantly I regretted it instantly <laughs> but my son my son actually wanted to try so heads up trigger warning or whatever this baby will freak out but he will also demand for more so there see he's like oh, it's spicy mommy yeah, it's really spicy give me milk so we did give him milk so he's freaking out don't worry he does this every single time he drinks or eats anything spicy but he will demand for more seriously like he'll demand for more see he'll open his mouth again knowing that it's spicy but he loved it as you can see he has milk and he just loves it okay so don't worry about the baby he's totally fine and apparently this product is very much Kali approved he actually almost finished the entire thing by himself Thanks for watching. Bye.